I've never done this. I've acted with children sometimes. Hey, Montserrat, come on over. We'll do the weather together. Might have to ped the camera down a little bit here. Are you there? Hello. Hello, are you there? Let's look up at the TV and point at the weather map. There we go. I'll get down here where you are. All right, so what are you going to see? Look over here. You're on TV. Yes, there we go. Oh, who's a good boy? All right, nobody's going to be listening to this weather report at all. That's the current temperature. You want to hit the button? There we go. <laughs> Mozzarella is gone. There we go. Now I'm going to stand back up. Ah. Good job, Mozzarella. All right, metro temperatures right now. We are in the 30s and 40s. It's going to be mild and dry overnight tonight. This is the next storm system coming our way. It is going to arrive Sunday night and Monday. It's not going to be a big deal. A high cloud site, not as cold. Low temperatures are going to be uh, dropping down. It looks like we'll see readings eh, more or less around 27 by morning in Denver. It will be cold up in Gunnison, 7 below up in the high mountain valleys. We also see that along the front range at 8 below at Kremlin. But in the metro area, it's going to be low to mid 30s and then some 20s, even a couple of teens farther to the north and east. Not as cold, some high clouds tomorrow morning. Midday, mostly sunny, mild and dry. And by the end of the day, it's going to be mostly clear and a nice Saturday for the Goldens and Golden and anything else you're doing. It's going to be upper 40s to low 50s at lower elevations. Again, a little cooler up across the northeast. Mountains great for skiing with temperatures in the 30s. 63 tomorrow coming up at Pueblo, 48 at Ray, out west, 45 at Grand Junction, 45 down at Cortez, Durango and Telluride around 40, mild and dry. Here comes the next front, but it really doesn't get into Colorado until Sunday night. And so as this storm system comes across, we'll get a little light snow and colder weather coming up on Monday, but it's not a major storm. As it moves east, it will become a stronger storm down over the Gulf Coast and the southern Mississippi Valley for Tuesday and Wednesday. Behind it, we clear sky, and then our next storm will be coming in here by Thursday. So on the seven-day forecast, looks like this. 52 tomorrow, mostly sunny. Clouds increase Sunday, but dry and mild with 50. We do get the snow Sunday night and Monday, but it's not a big storm. I'll step out of the way. It's looking like about three to five in the mountains and a half an inch or less for most of the plains. After that, Clearing skies Tuesday, mild and dry again Wednesday. Another storm system comes in Thursday with light snow and colder weather. Here's the 10 day outlook calling for us to be perhaps slightly colder than average, warmer conditions to the east of us, and perhaps just slightly wetter than average around here, but not a whole lot of precipitation in this seven day, just Monday and again Thursday, and both of those are rather minor storms.